this award. Well, I think it's wonderful that I'm getting this big award. I, uh, I have done a lot for the community, trying to make it a better place to live. And uh, I guess this award recognizes a lot of my efforts. Talk about some of the things that, that you've been able to accomplish in your 94 and a half years. Well, one, one thing that I want to mention is that uh, it was, I was a Cub Scout, a Boy Scout, and a Sea Scout when the Japanese bombed Singapore, Guam, Pearl Harbor, and the Philippines. I was a freshman at Boy College. And because I was a Sea Scout, I decided I'm going to join the Navy. And I did. I was in World War II. Uh, I was a deck officer on, on an LST, a tank landing ship. But uh, when I came back after the war ended, and I graduated from Boy College, and that's where I met Gene, by the way, and uh, I went, I had GI credits, so I went on to Madison and got a degree in business. And uh, then immediately after I got out of Madison, I was in Indianapolis. I was a sales rep for the West Bend Aluminum Company. That was the original name of the company going back to 1911. And then in 1961, the 50th anniversary, they dropped the word aluminum because we were using more stainless steel than we were aluminum. But anyhow, I was in Indiana in sales work, calling on um, accounts. And uh, I should tell you, when I was in Madison, I developed a friend who was Sigma Chi, lived across the street from me. And one day, Bert Cluster said to me, I'm gonna, when I get out of here, I'm going to work for the West Bend Aluminum Company. I said, well, when I get out of here, I'm going to work for the West Bend Aluminum Company. We both got the same identical territories based in Indiana. And Bert was in retail sales, and I was in premium promotion. I called on business firms. My products were used as incentives to increase the product sales of, of these uh, customers of mine. But uh, I think I forgot what your original question was. 